Hey gang, FLX Beer Reviews, back with another extravaganza, extravaganza. episode of Near Beers. Near Beers! Woo! Uh, Holy Dan, what are we drinking and why are there so many? <laughs> What's happening? Uh, Mike, as you can see, we have some beers, well, Near Beers, near beers. Uh, non-alcoholic choices from Untitled Art. Sure. Of, you, know, you could probably hold one up and I'll hold one up, but maybe we can get there. I'm going to hold three up. Okay. Wow, well, look at that. We got some untitled Ooh. art beers here. Um, where do we get these? <laughs> so, never buy uh, such thing. Uh, a friend and viewer of the channel, uh, I'll start we'll call him Bob. Oh, Robert. <laughs> <laughs> That's not his name. Um, but yeah, it could be. untitled art. It's out right of Wanaki. Wisconsin, One and um, Wisconsin. Yeah, it's the place to visit with your pets and friends. Uh, so the Best Buy, they don't do they do Best Buys. So this is seven thirty twenty five on this one. Okay, so we're good. Uh, yeah, but I would think I don't know with the hops, you'd probably. Well, there's no hops in these. You can't put hops in non alcoholic so, beer. That's a moldy bitch. I <laughs> <laughs> uh, say an untapped rating right there. <laughs> oh, she's a multi bitch. <laughs> Uh, so we've had, um, we've had Untold Our NA on the uh, channel before. Yes. And I believe it was, we did the S'mores and the West Coast, I think. Maybe we did the Haze too. I don't know. Ah, possibly. Now I've yeah. had the Italian style pills uh, at a beer tuber palooza where Sean oh, from sour. Nerd Sense and I masterfully, masterfully, Deduce that that was the mystery beer from Joe from the Beer Patrol. Oh, it was a thing of beauty. That's sneaky. That's so <sighs> sneaky. We set the bar for mystery beers. All okay. right. Um, so, yeah. Mike, you've had... Right. So I've had this. Okay. These I haven't had. All right. So let's just work yeah, our way down. looks very interesting. Yes, it does. Um, well, do you want to go hazy first or... We got to go down. Just... Okay. All right. We'll All right. start with the pills. We'll Our start pills. with the pills. Um, That's what they call the 10 seat touch. <laughs> Oh, Mikey, Tennessee Touch. I'm drinking. It's good. Uh, it smells... Uh, I, what I remember from the Untitled Lark beers we've had, like, they don't have that traditional, like, N.A. aroma to it. Where you're like, ah, oh, it's a little tingy, you know, I don't know if yeah. I like that. But it, it smells like a Pilsner. A little tea qualities. Okay. I, can, oh. I still get a nice little lemon zest to it. Oh, yeah, that's very citrusy. Yeah, that's nice. It's there's not a lot pleasant. of malt to that. Like this is what I just remember thinking. I would drink this regularly. This is good. Mm. You can definitely tell it's it's either if you were doing this blind, it's like definitely a super sessionable because mm -hmm. of the low ABV, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if I was doing it blind, I would know exactly that this is a non-alcoholic. What did you say during the blind? Uh, we both. I think Sean said. One of us said Pilsner, and the other one of us said non-alcoholic. It wasn't even. Okay, so who who said non-alcoholic? One of us said non-alcoholic, okay, and one of us remember? said Pilsner. Okay. No, and we were both just like, this is All great right. teamwork. Let's, let's... Uh, next, I'm really excited I mean, to try this fruit look, look at it. Sour. If you didn't know, you'd think that was a heavily fruited sour. Oh yeah, I'd be like, oh, this is for yeah. quantum just fruits. Oh, there's even pectin and shit. It smells like a. That's oh, smell. this is like this weird oniony garlicky thing going on. I, mean, I got spaghettios right off. <laughs> spaghettios, he says. I don't know what's going on. Oh no, no, there it is. <laughs> was it dragon fruit? What is it? Yeah, mango dragon. Mango. Oh, okay. mango. I get the yes. mango. The so sometimes the mango. I sometimes get. mango can almost have a peppery oh, note to it. I love mango. Do you ever get that? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> I mean. Now that. Like for non-alcoholic fruited sour? It's good. It's a little thicker. That's delicious. It's got a bit of a creamy taste to it. It's a little crisp. The fruits aren't overpowering, but they're very balanced and mango. I would buy more of that and be like, hey, Nikki, you want fruited sour? Yeah. Yeah. And see what she says. A little bit of a, a bready note. 
in the background, but that is delicious. Oh my god. Dude. Wow. Okay, but here's the question. If you're drinking this, what's just stopping you from buying a Sobe or something? I like want a, like a like a, a fruit. I want that 0.5% ABV. Is there? I mean, they're all like less than 0.5%. <laughs> so that's always what I think about. Yeah, less than. Yeah. Uh, so 90 calories, 16 grams of carbs. All right, there. I bet Sobe's got way more calories. Not for nothing. I mean, but you can get a vitamin water, zero that's or whatever. True. But no, I mean, it does fulfill because it's got some body to it. It's like yeah, fruit. it does. It's like it really fruit. does. It. it, it uh, I, I feel like from a non-alcohol standpoint, you, this is hard to beat. Just because you can mask everything with the fruit. Yeah, I, I think you're right. That's delicious. Though. It really that's is. That's like drinking morning juice. Off to a great start. Oh, there. I love the carbonation. It's got a little zippy. All right, what do we got next? Uh, Citra haze. Yep. Okay, Citra haze. Um. A little golden color, right? Yeah, very golden. Very, like, uh, pear juice. Yeah, a little sediment. Oh, my gosh. Wow. That is so citrusy. I was not expect. I was not either. Lemon, very lemon-lime citrusy. Dude, that's like a... A little bright orange in yeah. there. Yeah. That's like lemon dawn. Yes! Oh my god, yeah, absolutely. Like lemon dawn soap. <laughs> now again, much like bacteria, you probably don't want to print that on the can. <laughs> but it is it's citrusy dish soap. <laughs> All right. Yeah. All right, cheers. <laughs> My least favorite of the bunch. So this is where the pledge comes in. <laughs> Check out our review of Until Dark. I'm not going to call it. Until Dark. It's like they're comparing us to cleaning supplies. You these, gotta. These uh, idiots. You got a dresser you need to polish? or <laughs> No, it's it's okay. It's okay. This one's not hitting for me. Any fruit flavor in there is very artificial. A lot of lemon, though. There's a lot of lemon. They say citra, but this is lemon. Orange, but lemon. Pithy. It's kind of kind of dry, pithy. I got to say, so far, though, the body on these has been pretty good. Substantial for what they are. Yeah, yeah I, I completely agree. Real kosher, too. That's good. Finally. All right, what's this last one? Uh, juicy IPA. All right. I think we may have had this one. I think a long time ago. Right. It looks... It looks like a single IPA. It has that haze to it. It's dull orange. Nice little half finger ahead on it. It, it has the look. So, okay. Um, I definitely like this more than the haze one. Yeah, so this one has this really nice... Um, Not a whole lot in the aroma. No. But this has a... Uh, Mm. It's a bit perfumey. It's got a really nice, like almost like some Simcoe qualities to it. That oh, you get off Simcoe, like absolutely some pineapple kind of. Uh, I agree. Like floral. Uh, it's tropical floral. Like yeah. your 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 pear. Um, are those Hawaiian flowers. You know the the red ones, the white. That's what it reminds me of. Oh, okay, I don't remember. I know they are. Um. No, I, I enjoy this one. A little bit of bready characteristic to it. Um, slightly drying. Uh, decent. Uh, the mouth feels kind of... It's got a nice spritzy carbonation, but... I would say... Out of all these, the carbonation is what stands out to me. As far as the dominating factor. Mm -hmm. Like, throughout all of them. Yeah. Well, mm. like, it's a good amount of carbonation yeah. through all of them. See, once you go to this juicy and you go back to this, this is just straight, just... No good. It's right. just, like, lemon cleaner. Okay, yeah, yeah that, that's like... my... So, out of them so far, I'm saying the, the haze one is... I don't need that ever again. Yeah. This is a solid non-alcoholic IPA. This is the clear number one. Fruit, that fruited sour, man, like... This is where it's at. I think you'd be hard... I never would have guessed a fruited sour I don't know where to buy. I don't know where to buy this, though. Age... Now AJ's is closed? Yeah, it's closed. Yeah, that's where I used to get my non alcoholic. I think beer. you can order these online. I'll have to keep an eye out now. Um, I, I really like this pills. I like it just as much as I liked it before. This one's still. Yeah, it's no good. Um 
two thumbs up on Kubi? this one. Kubi time? Uh, yeah. Kubi? Uh, Kubi? Hold on. Okay. Kubi? Kubi? I give this a 2.5. Yeah, yeah. I'm like 1.9. I'll give this a 3.8. I give this a 4.1. And I'll give this a 3.75. Okay. 1.5. I'll give this a I'll, three nine. I'll give this a four. Man, I'll give this a four point five. I like the pills are a little more than the sour. Let's freaking do it. Oh boy, I don't want to ruin the sour though. It's so terrible. Like it's so terrible to ruin such a good. It really is. But you know like, what? That's a good beverage. This is what we do. You know, this is what we do for you guys. We're taking one for the team. Wow, that sour just overtook the <laughs> color. Right. No, my, my glasses weren't exactly all even, but whatever. Now, I don't care who you are. That is a fine-looking beverage. <laughs> I mean, that, that looks like a new England like IPA now. Beer, right? if, if someone poured, hey, you're at the ball game and you come back with that, yo, bro, where'd you get that beer? If someone told me this was like a grapefruit forward Kettle sour, I'd say okay. If someone I could see the IPA, if someone told me this was like uh, a d dragon fruit raspberry IPA, I'd be like okay. Like this looks like a good beer. Look at that head, foamy, thick. Uh, that sour. It smells like <laughs> it smells like the sour. It smells like a citrus infused sour. <laughs> citrus infused sour with a little crackeriness of the pilsner. A little zesty. Even yeah. even these three beers don't want this one around. Like they're driving it away. They've killed it in here. It's gone. Be gone, you devil. Gone. I got two words for you. Kentucky hug. Off. Oh. And fuck. <laughs> in that order. <laughs> Should we dive in? Yeah. Cheers. All right. Thanks, Robert. Bob. I mean, it's, it's not bad. It isn't the worst thing. I think the the majority of the beer, the the sour remains the the forefront of that beer. Yours has more sour in it. So mine's more IPA. Okay. Oh yeah, you're right, but that's still good. Like that's good. But I, I still the sour's I, still there. I still taste the stink off that one though. I might have killed it. They they destroyed it. They said you're done. I, I get I get the fruited sour magic, a little bit of this uh, the, the IPA, so, and the crackery. So let me get this down. straight. So what we've learned is basically just go buy all these, throw them in a jug, mix it up, and say yeah, it's summertime. Like remember making suicides at the at the soda fountain when you were a kid at like Burger King or something, and you're getting all the sodas I, in there. I mean, how do you want me to answer that? Yes, I do remember that, Mike. This so, is great. So what I was going to say was, yes, I remember that, and I remember still doing it whenever I go to Five Guys because they have that soda machine. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right, so perfect. It uh, when I go to AMC theaters, when I used to see movies all the time, the, you always got to get you gotta get the the quarter uh, orange high C, you get the quarter cherry Sprite, and then sometimes you throw in a quarter lemonade. It's banging. I want to be able to visit Untitled Arts, and for them to have a machine like that, so I can just make my own. Suicide. By machine, you like that? You're gonna go there. They're gonna have a tasting room, and the bartender's gonna be like, "Hi, what can I get you?" And you're gonna be like, "Step aside." And you're just back there, just. <laughs> I know what I'm doing. Yeah. I'm a tastemaker. I am. Whoa, 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 sir! Don't you want some of the Citra Haze in there? And I just slap it out of his hands. <laughs> I'll take a case, and then you walk outside. <laughs> They're all just looking at you as you're in the middle of the parking lot, just pouring it out. <sighs> Don't drink this pledge. Um, no, but on a serious note, I'm not saying that's a bad product. It just tastes awful. <laughs> um, no, in, in comparison to these. In comparison to these. Sure. On its own, I'm sure it might stand up a little bit. Okay. What's the best by date? <laughs> Never. It'll never be good. 228, 2025. So actually, I, I think this is a, actually probably a fairly old. salvage here? What are you, like, <laughs> some sort of, what Who's salvaging? You are. You're like, I mean, you know, it's, it's terrible, but it's not bad. Well, you know, I want, I want you know, to date. Like, 
Dude, we just said these three are fantastic. That That's good. All four weren't going to be great. I mean, that's I okay. Know. To me, this is okay, to me. This one's kind of mad. Yeah, they're all good. Did this one? This is the star of the show. It's okay. Yeah. This is the star. It's like we never did it. <laughs> wow, these three non-alcoholic beers from Untitled <laughs> Listen, are fantastic. If you really just want to just go all out and impress somebody and fake them out, I think this is good. I think this would make a good mystery beer. I agree. I think. I wish I had another. Not can, for me and Sean. We'd so I can right pour it in glass. Give it to the other half of that Felix and be like, what do you think? I think it's fantastic she'll love it. to do. You uh, took another sip on your own. I have been taking sips. It's delicious. Is it? Yes. I've said it multiple times. Yeah, I think he's playing it up. Oh, like you're a play of your... Uh, what was that other one? I can't even remember it anymore. It's gone. <laughs> it's on top the way it should be. <laughs> Anyway, Bob, Bert, thank you for giving us these non-alcoholic beers. This is super fun to try. This is a delicious summertime beverage. I'm loving every time. Thanks for watching, everybody. Cheers.